Hey everybody, welcome to another Illusioner. I'm Brandon. I'm Ishmael. Malachi. Alright, just finished watching Bad Batch episode 8, Bounty Lost. Yep, pretty fun, right? Mm -hmm. Pretty cool episode. Mandalorian. I got my Rex in today. I have my finger. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Mandalorian. I don't want to know what you do with that finger. Or what you do with it today. You probably What's that it? smell? Is this smells <laughs> fart? Oh, God. Yeah, Rex is Mandalorian. Cool. All right. What y'all think of this episode? It was okay. There was a lot of action in it. Yeah, it was right. A lot of fighting. Bounty hunter on bounty hunter action. Mm. Yeah, it's pretty it's fun. Late. Oh Lord. Yeah, it is. It's almost eleven. I gotta hurry up. I gotta go to work tomorrow. So yeah, we start off. We get to see uh, Cad Bane. He has Omega, of course. Mm -hmm. I forget, what's his little droid's name? I forgot. I forgot. I, uh, Toto. Toto. Yeah, we'll go with Toto. Yeah, we'll go with his that. His name was Toto. Okay. Toto. We have him talking to Omega. Omega's trying to coerce him and stuff, get him to turn over, help her out so she can get free. Mm -hmm. And then Cad Bane's like, well, well, he actually talked to the Kaminoans and they're like, you know, do you have her? He's like, I have her alive. I said, good. Okay, mm -hmm. gonna get extra money for that. So, but then yes, Omega ends up getting the droid to. Well, she keeps like asking him if he needs help with his leg and everything, and then he ends up letting her help him, and she does. She's nice, but then she ends up like knocking him out, giving yeah. him like a little stun. I so mean, yeah, he goes to sleep. She still helped him. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. She yeah. still helped him, but then she kind of like Knocked put him out. to sleep. Yeah. Nighty night. So, yeah, what else? Um, and then, um, this, like, thing that had, like, this long neck guy fell on top of the girl. Oh, well, that's later. Well, we come to find out that, that the Kaminoans want to use Omega's blood. Well. They want to use her blood to create other ones of her because yeah. she's actually a full-blooded Generation 1. Yeah. So she's technically a female version of Boba Fett. Yeah. And so they wanted to take her back and then they wanted to kill her. Yeah, they basically wanted to get her genetic. Can you stop moving? You know, get her DNA enough to make, you know, new clones. And then they're just going to terminate her. It was the prime minister named Lama Su. He ends up sending, who is it, Tan Wei to try to get the clone because the other girl doesn't want to kill Omega. You know, yeah. she likes her, she's nice. She's nice. So she wants Omega to live, so they send the other one because they were like, your personal investments in, you know, in Omega or whatever is... They don't even call her Omega, they just call her the asset. You know, it's clouding your judgment, so they send the other one, you know, to get her. Yeah. And, yeah, the clones end up finding out that, yeah, her DNA is different. So she's basically just a pure... She's... Stop. She's basically just a pure clone like, like Boba Fett is from Django because they've, they've pretty much run out of genetic material to make more clones so they need another clone to have a, like a base so that's what omega is so that's what they're going to use her for yeah but we never figured out what's her true meaning her true purpose yeah. that's her purpose is to be the new the new template for the new clones they're going to make so what well, something must have happened later on because they don't have the new clones yeah probably well they can't catch her so that's why so that's why well, maybe she dies no, I don't think so. But, yeah, it's a big thing where uh, he goes to collect the bounty. And then, surprise, surprise, Phoenix Shan shows up. And she actually killed killed Tonway. So then we have a pretty cool fight between Phoenix Shan and Cad Bane. It's pretty it cool. Actually really awesome. She actually kicked the crap out of him pretty good, right? And then Cad Bane kicked her in the face. He headbutted her with his metal head. He had a metal head? He didn't kill her. She yeah. didn't kill her. I know I'm saying she kicked his butt though, but did you know? Did you know Cad Bane actually has that whole apparatus so he can't get choked up by by uh, by Jedi's, really? by Force users? Yeah. But then he then they say he used to run with the Jedi. No, he used to have run-ins with the Jedi's because he was back in Clone War days. So he would fight Jedi's. Yeah, he fought. Uh, he fought Obi Wan before he, he lost. He didn't lose, but, you know, he always ends up just being like a stalemate. And they ended up catch, capturing him at one point, but he was in jail. But, of course, he got away. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, God, I moved the camera. All right, so yeah, like I said, pretty much Phoenix Shan showed up. She, they basically, she didn't get her back, but basically the whole thing, the, the Bad Batch ended up showing up again and rescuing her. So. And then um, at the end, um, the guy told um, the other guy to tell Omega what's going to happen to her. Yeah. They ended up telling her the truth so she knows what's going to happen. Omega came out safely with the clones and... Okay, what about that part with the little vats? Was that like... Did that look like a... Snoke. Did that look like a Snoke? That's or did it I look like you. a Kaminoan? It looked like a Kaminoan. What, the long neck thing? Yeah. I have to go back. It could have been like a Snoke looking thing or a Kaminoan. Interesting. Just maybe we'll go back and look at it again. But, I don't know, basically that's it. She's back with the Bad Batch now. Like I said, they basically told her the truth. Why the Kaminoans want to take her? What do they want to use her for? And they're like, you're never going to go back. Right. So, but Phoenix Shan. Phoenix Shan was actually trying to be nice, I guess. Because she was like, I can keep hunting her down if yeah, y'all want me to. because she wanted the Omega to, like, stay alive. Yeah. And she let her get away. Can you get your yeah, so basically Phoenix Shan was like... You know, the same clones before, you know, have her. She was like, I can hunt her down if you want me to, but it's going to cut you. She's like, no, as long as she's with the clones, I know she's okay. So she basically is fine with her with them as long as she knows she's going to be safe. So that's basically it. So, yeah, let us know what y'all think. It's pretty cool. Pretty fun, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, if you would, please like the video. Subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell for notifications. There you go. And we'll see. See you in the next one. All right. Bye. Bye. Wait. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I'll kick your butt, Mandalorian. Oh, God. <laughs>